Boom, what up? Solar neck only here, back to some more legal lens. Actually, on buddy, I'm, I'm Q poking you. Q poking and running. All right. This is probably going to be an annoying matchup, but hey. Probably not as bad as Karma. Oh, I was, I was early, dude. I was way early. Oops. Dang, no mana flow band makes Mike a sad boy. There's no way this is a winning trade for you, though. If I have a shield before it happens, there's no way it's a winning trade. So just wait, get our shield, and then repeat. Eh, I probably shouldn't use either. I could have got that minion without wasting mana. That's alright. Really just gonna let this wave crash under tower. Q, walk away. Beautiful. If he doesn't get the E off, I definitely win the trade. Because he's trading into my passive shield. It's like 9% of my health. Pretty good. Mana flow band's about to be up. I'm gonna put another point in the queue. Pop potion here. I want that mana flow band, but he's sitting so far back. Auto E. There we go. Run away, make sure we don't get hit by her E. Yeah. Not the best. Yeah, it just wasn't worth doing any of that. I should have just missed the farm. Lame. Look for a Q. Walk away. I want to walk into this bush because she's going to chase me and my jungle is going to kill her. I got the E hit. Walk in this bush. Pop potion. Look to Q. Nice. Yeah. Just As long as I walked up into that bush, it's pretty obvious that she was just going to get baited into walking into me. Should be able to just shove and leave. The jungle is like up here. Damn. I have to ward. If I'm going to stay. Just doesn't make sense for the jungle to stick around though. So there's nothing to really do here. Q Max, alright. Get the cannon, get on out. Yeah, it just didn't make sense for the jungle to stay. Like the crab was already gonna be gone, so she's probably gonna go to the other side. So we can just drop a ward and be pretty safe there. Uh here I think we wanna buy this first. Could get a potion too, I guess. Eh. I think I should be fine just to Q poke twice, try and get to my level six, use R, go for an all in. Whenever you do AP on Malphite, you need to really work around your Ignite and R and like take all in fights. Poke a couple times with Q, all in fight. Oh, nice. Damn, E damage is wild. Does Diana say GG after she got a kill? Like, <laughs> nice, dude. Oh, All right, step one, hit Q. Boop, run away. Nice, look at that trade. Into the shield, it's 55 extra damage. Don't care. Wait for our Q to be up and look for the same trade again. Probably just gonna clear this wave out at our tower. Let me have R. She boarded the river. Probably gonna drop E here and back up. Nice. I mean, I'm looking at Q, but she's just sitting back. Makes sense. No need to take free damage for her. Oh, she did anyways. Back up. We have an ult right now if this guy sticks around. Man, how about I see that shit coming and I still do it? Dumb. I could leave right now. It's probably a good idea. Yeah, yank in mid lane. Could have been a little earlier on my ping. Hard to know if the guys sitting in the bush are actually leaving. Ward this. Cool. Shove next wave. Maybe reset? be okay. Get all of this. Noise. Could stick around here, look to Q as well. 
I don't mind a reset though. Grab this. Actually, I could go here and here. Might be the better route. Boots works pretty well with my Q. And now I'm trying to play this lane. I'm trying to run up, Q poke, run away, run up, Q poke, run away. Bolt, kill. Ideally, run up, Q poke, she E's me. And then on the next Q, her E won't be back up. And I can Q R. Use the R to get on top of her and just, she dies. Be pretty straightforward. I need to hold this wave. She is rotating, so as long as my teammate doesn't die here, we should be good. I think he's going to die here. Dang. It's unfortunate. Oh no, he gets out. Okay. Let me hold the wave. She missed an entire wave so far. She might miss more here. She's just chilling there. I think I shove now. The wave is going to break the freeze anyways. Okay, that looks good. The jungle is rotating too. We got two. One for one. And yeah, one for two. That's fine. Noise. Hit tower. This guy's dead, but going to come back with ultimate. Be able to get up here. Stand over here. Stand here. Oh, actually, it doesn't matter anymore. I forgot. What used to happen is the minions like might retarget and hit the uh, like my minions might retarget and hit the red minions, which would mean less damage on the tower, which would mean less likely to get the uh, plate. That's not how it works anymore. They change it up. The minions stay locked into the tower once they start. And bye. Like I said, two Qs and then all in. Well, Q1, let the poke happen, then R with the second Q. Especially with Ignite. Very easy. I shouldn't be here. The jungle can come. Uh, I don't want any of these. Oh, there it is. Noise. Grab this. Kind of annoying that I have 500 gold here. I mean, I guess I can buy one of these. I don't know. I think I sit on 500. Alternatively, I think I could have gone like, oh, I guess boot upgrade. Isn't it the same thing? I don't think I can get an amp tone with the boot upgrade though. If I could get boot upgrade and an amp tone, that would have been what I should do. I think I already had the amp tone, right? I don't remember. Maybe I had a better buy. Uh, 50 seconds. So, chilling, looking to get a poke off. Right in the bush. I mean, that one is like so good where she doesn't even E. She's gonna look to do it here, but we come out of the bush first. Oh my god. See what I mean? Just such an easy way to get an advantage. You can also do a very similar build with just full tank too. Like you don't have to go full AP. It's just the full AP route is really good against people who try and poke you. If it's like a melee tank, like maybe the Q poke build doesn't really work as well. Well, you still max Q even if you do the tank build, unless you're doing like the grass W one. But yeah, it's like two Q pokes on a range champion like this, and then you can just R. And it's really hard for them to punish you. Like right here, just. One Q, walk away. Once the tower drops aggro, R in. Sweet. Uh, should be okay. Noise. And slap up tower, auto W. Sweet, walk up here, reset. Probably no reason to actually walk into the bush there. They're both dead. Nobody can come and kill me. It's probably like a waste of three seconds, but should be fine. Grab this and go. Noise. Moving to mid lane. Todd Frums. Thanks for the prime, buddy. Welcome. Axe one, three months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Uh could rotate mid or something. Mm -hmm. OK, 
Okay. Cannon? Cannon? No. Ah, uh, they're in mid lane right now, so I just shove. Uh, let's wait. Uh, she's gonna try and ult, huh? She's probably walking this way. Make more sense. I can walk down here and get a ward over. Ooh. Seems decent. We can just get this guy to leave. Look where this guy is, though. Not in lane. Which means I should probably run. I don't want a 1v2 when I don't have ultimate. Seems pretty dumb. So I'm just gonna walk back up here. Clear the wave out. Ludens! Back up. I have no spells. Walk in here. I think I didn't get spotted. Okay. Still gotta be careful because Diana can rotate around. She uh, swept that ward out, so... I think I probably just want to shove wave quickly. No. Level 11, more R damage. Sweet. Q first. Nice. Oh my god, dude, that damage is wild. I gotta leave. I think I could have W'd and then left. A little too afraid that I was gonna take too much damage. I got her flash out of her. Oh, back up. This could be bad. Probably just gonna reset here. Get this, go here. Seems like a good time. Lucian's pretty fed. Sweet. Much better farming this time. Uh, what am I doing? Loot in Shadow Flame Death Cap. Yes. It's gonna be a lot of flat pen. 10 to 20 pen here based on target's current health. <laughs> the phase rush, phase rush on Garen is so annoying. Dun, 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 dun. Much for coaching. Nice is too expensive. Nice isn't even doing content anymore, brother. I don't know if you missed it. She's taking a break for a while. Okay. Oop. Cannon acquired. I right, got a tower here. Easy. We could even like leave it low, try and bait. Try and bait uh, Quinn to like walking up and then just all in her. She's no flash this time. Uh, I could probably rotate the dragon. And they surrendered. Is this how like 5v5 just goes now? I've had three games and all of them have just been 15 minute surrenders. So. Yay! <laughs> Jesus. Alright, well, GG. Well played. Um, what up? Solar Renek can only hear back to him some more League of Legends action. Finding it set. I'm gonna hit him with the Q. Hey, buddy, don't be hiding in that bush. I'll, I'll ward it. Got him. Mana flow band procced. Don't do it, jerk. Don't do it. Okay. Oh wait, that was stupid. Wasted my Q without having a mana flow band up. Come here, buddy. There we go. That's how you want to do it. Should be good here. And auto this one twice. Get it? Nice. Wait for the mana flow band. Hit him. I mean, Malphite's got a pretty boring lane phase. It's kind of very straightforward. Use mana flow band Brock. Then you just kind of want to sit back, get your shield up before you take any fights. Passive. Passive is up. Mana flow bands up in a second. I can even pop a potion before I do it, get a little extra damage off. We don't really care about the uh, health from these potions. Ooh, nice. And prep this minion up. Two autos should be good. Nice. I might actually leave right here. 
Are you gonna leave here? Oh no, he's just doing that. Nice, I got that other minion. Oh, I shouldn't have hit. No, that was right. Okay. Sweet. Got him with the Q slow. Uh. Oh, this should be good. Yeah. This should be good. Can you help me get the wave? Oh, actually, there's no uh, teleport. I should be fine. If you had TP, then I need help. Dang. Honestly, the Malphite, or Malphite, the uh, Mord could re could like rotate back here and kill me right there. My teammate was pretty close by, so. I need to buy some AP. So I'm gonna go Ludens. I think I just wait and get this. I could go here and Dark Seal is probably fine, but I think this with Q poke should be good. I can run back on this wave because the slow pushes to me. No incentive to TP. I can hold it, find a better spot. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, you can get a pretty cheap computer. I bought one for the office the other day, and it was like, I don't know, five. I mean, it's an office computer, so it doesn't really have to have like gaming stuff in it. But League of Legends is super easy to run. And I bought the computer for like 500 bucks. So and if you have monitors already, you can get, you can go pretty cheap. So I feel like the monitors are the expensive part nowadays. I mean, if you go high end PC or whatever, you can easily spend like three, four grand, which is absurd for League of Legends. So definitely don't do that. I guess it depends. If you play other video games that are like, really demanding or if you have a bigger budget you know why not Bloop. oh a little early i didn't have my medical band up mistakes were made e w dodges q follow him follow him q beautiful pop these it's pretty good for me the set has really good sustain with the passive when he gets low but i think i'll just out poker with my q the jungle is in mid, bot side mid. I'm just gonna last hit here, make my opponent miss farm. Okay. Does that work? It does. He could have W'd and then flashed, and I think he would have survived. But he tried to flash and then probably W afterwards. Just using a level up, using a little power spike action. Shove this wave in a tower and probably just reset, right? Don't demolish? I don't think so. Eh, I can get a plate here. I don't think I want to stay for the wave though. Ugh. Please don't follow me. That's kind of depressing. Was it because I was far up? I guess. That's kind of annoying. It's alright. We can TB back on this wave. It's not a big deal. It kind of looks like the same scenario as before, but it's a little bit different because this wave doesn't push back to me as fast. So I end up losing more minions in the last example. It's not a required teleport, but probably decent enough. At this point, when we have Metaflow Band, we can just queue on, on cooldown. Metaflow Band plus uh, Lost Chapter. Oops, that was a bit greedy. Pop potion. E, try and clear the wave, get a reset here. Reset on the wave, not on me. Q, back away. Again, we're just queuing on cooldown at this point. Nice, that's huge. Pop potion again. E here. Ooh, hi TF. QTF, and just run. Sweet. Pop potions. Get a ward down. Sweet. I bolt in a second. Pretty good setup for us. Just chilling. Do that. 
The wave's not a freeze, so I kind of want to kill it quickly. All right, decent. Look like they're diving TF. That's actually pretty good. He has flash, I think. Oh, what? He didn't even lose vision, though. How'd that cancel it? I don't understand that one. It's one thing if you flash into a bush, like you lose vision, it makes sense. I don't know, maybe Larry was like spam right clicking as he did the R and he like clicked after he did it. So he like move commanded and that's what canceled it. Cause if you don't lose vision, they can't flash your R. Oh, it works. And he had minions pushed up, so I don't think he lost vision. Unless he lost it for like a split second or something, but hmm, it's a bit odd. It was a bit odd. Sit here, look for Qs, dodge that, Q. Nice. I can look to just shove wave and reset probably. Especially when I randomly take a tower shot. Oops. Nope. Could argue that I'm supposed to go for an all in before I leave. Probably not a bad idea. Get the Q. Can stack this wave up. If I wanted his wave to push, this is exactly what I would do. Because look, it... John, how badly did you miss that R? <laughs> Run, John. I don't know if this guy left or not. Oh, shit. Oh no, he's still here. Okay. Still here. Oh, dang. Shove this in. Oh no. I could hit that Q. Okay. I have enough for my item. Probably just want to back and get it. Definitely back in the bush here. I just already started it and I know where the jungler is, so. It's kind of dumb to do that. Sweet. Let's move. Let's move. We're up a lot of farm. Why does the Comet Q do more damage than the when it's on cooldown even before Comet hits? What? I don't know what you're asking, my friend. Maybe I got more items? I don't really know. I think I'm supposed to just do this. I'll run at him. Ooh. Surprise, he's gone. He has no teleports, so I want to shove. For whatever reason, to Ghost. I don't think it's a good idea. Probably decent in teamfights, but... I think you probably want Ignite. It's a really good combat summoner for set. Or you just want Teleport. It's going to be better in most scenarios. Now we just sit back, press Q on cooldown. Hey, man! Take that. What you can do is that, what I just did there, start walking up before it's back up. A lot of times people, they miss out like damage uptime because they just sit here and they just wait. All right, now my Q is up. Now I will walk forward. It's like you can pre like preemptively do a lot of this stuff. And get in range right before it comes back up and just be spamming it. At the end of the day, if he's missing all this farm, I'm coming out ahead anyways. He's worried about me Q-poking him. He's got enough regen that it's probably fine for him just to eat a couple of Q-pokes to try and deal with the wave. And I think he's underestimating how much damage he does to me right now. Because he can kind of blow me up. Because I'm full squishy. I just want to go slow. Last hit the minions. Make him lose blue minions. So if I do this for like an entire wave, or entire uh, two waves rather, it's essentially like I just got a kill. 
And it gets the EXP, which is fine. So he's still scaling into the game. But missing two waves of gold is pretty important. And then there's nothing making it, so it stays at two. Like, it can easily be three waves. It could easily be four waves. If he's giving up two, why isn't he... And he might just give up four, you know? If he gives up four, he might just give up five. If he gives up five... Sorry. Now eventually the wave's gonna end up pushing because I'm last hitting and he's not, even if I'm being perfect. I didn't prep the wave to freeze. R2, D2. Boop. Pop that potion. Check for pink, walk back. Two, one, get in range, press Q, run away. Nice. He's probably gonna W here. Uh, I probably could have walked up and tried to slap the tower once. Oh, aw, oh, close. I probably could have done it, just playing a little safe, honestly. Ooh, do I get all of them? Nice. Q poke. Just gotta be careful for the scorch. Q poke. It's pretty close to being killable. It's just. Oh, that was hittable. I need to stay closer to him there. So if I wanted to wave the freeze, this is what I would do. I would hold it as far back on his side as I can. And walk into the bush. It'll nuke the first minion, which gives it another advantage, but just the fact that it's on his half of the map is more than enough of it of an advantage. Actually, it depends. Eh, it's not a big enough buff yet. The thing is, your Q is a single target spell. So when I Q, all his minions hit me. And that's what causes the wave to push back. He's going to walk up and use his W, yeah. I mean, he's just playing really safe. But the thing is, I have a 50 CS lead now, so. Play as safe as you want. I'm going to be a monster this game. Q, bail, ward here. Oh, you just leave. Oh wow, I hit. I think I just die. Mm -hmm. I could R over, but I'm dead to ignite. I didn't think I was going to get hit by the E. I was about to even say, like, as long as I walk in a straight line here, I should be, uh, fine. <laughs> the problem I thought is if I, like, tried to hug this wall, because then he, his E is shorter distance, right? And I'm trying to go here rather than just going here. Because you want to walk in, like, a straight line away from him. Boot 2 versus no boots. Hard to beat that one. I have TP. I can join this fight over there. Oh shit. Oh no, it's probably not necessary. Yeah. Alright, whoops. I thought they were both gonna live. I thought this guy was gonna kite this way, and I thought Brand was gonna live there too. I thought wrong. Still look for an R play somewhere. Just where though? Or here, probably just clear the next wave and then do something else. Maybe a rotate top, trying to get a kill there. The two of us should be able to kill. Yeah, if he moves this way, I should be able to help. Either or, either or. He doesn't have R, so I think this is actually winnable. I'm pretty sure they know I'm here though. I mean, I think this is probably fine. He doesn't have R. So it should just be one shotable, yeah. Q. Nice. Yeah. Now if I use a Oh, I forgot there was a tower here, bro. God damn, where my head at? Sweet. Should be fine, I mean, don't have anybody that could send. I guess Brand could rotate here, but that's not gonna do anything.
Sweet. Uh, probably just walk up here. I think TF is gonna ult, yeah. How long on dragon? One minute. Uh, I gotta be careful. If I run into Malphite, I think I might just die. Oh. Speaking of. Behind me over there. He has R now. Gotta be a little bit more careful. Damn, these plants suck. They don't reduce your cooldown. Lame. How much health does this guy have? You want him to- oh, okay. How did that work? Was it because he queued? Or, no, he ulted and his ult is unstoppable. Okay. Right? Because he ulted? Dodge with Q? That's what I thought it looked like. Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I'd be pretty annoyed if I was the Malphite. Dude, I'm, I I cannot ever play games where I, there's a Malphite, a Maokai, and a Mord in the game. I just continuously say the wrong one. I don't know why. I would be annoyed if I was him. There we go. Got it. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna sell this and get my item here. Gotta wait a little bit gold. Might as well dance a little bit. Wow, look at these moves. Look at these moves. First time in the club. How do we dance? Just like this, baby. All right. This is gonna be a huge item buy. I have so much flat pen here. Blow people up. Kaboom. R's doing 521. Q 417. E 432. W. Probably like a couple hundred. Then obviously this procs. I know I can one-shot that guy. I think the... Ooh, I was going to say the idea here should be to walk in these bushes, but... Pretty sure I might kill him when he walks here. Alright, well this guy's going to die. Yeah. You in this bush? Oh, did he go around still? Ah. AP Malphite, bro. What a stupid ass champion. <laughs> oh, God. Go boom. <laughs> Outplayed? Yeah. Pretty much. Pretty much. I pressed R. Get owned. Just does so much damage, and you guarantee everything. Because they're knocked up from R, so the Q's gonna hit, and the E's gonna hit, and you can auto W. So it just... It's kind of too much damage for most people to deal with. I mean, if you, like, int on this champion, or, you know, it's pretty bad, but... If you get snowballing, you get rolling a little bit. Uh, this might be okay if he hits that, because I can Q the brand, and that's a kill. Ooh. Hold up. Put a Q for him. I don't have R yet, so it's kind of awkward. W there. Q. Nice. I think I can kill this guy. Q's gonna land. I think I... I was gonna say, I think I have to flash, but I don't even think I have to. Nah, that's not enough damage. Oh! Get him, John! I totally baited John to die. <laughs> Ah, worth, worth it. All right. There you go. Let him know. <laughs> Step it up, John. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, not bad. Death cap or void? I think I'm gonna. Oh, actually no. I was gonna upgrade this. I think it's still probably correct. Can go here. Sweet. 
I'm gonna run bot. How much is my damage? How much is my R doing now? Uh, 595, 502, 467. Not nearly as much of an increase as I thought. 60%, 20%, 60%, 90%. Huh. Just the fact that you hit them all at the same time, though. Right, they can all be around four or 500, but if you hit them all at once, it's like 2,000, you know? Plus it's AoE, minus the Q. Ooh, I have a teleport mid. Eh. And just keep pushing. That's not a bad idea. Oh my god. I can just R them. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why they were on that side of the map. That's kind of odd. Like, I was going to do that to set, but I was like, eh, it's probably not worth it. I can wait for them all to show up at tower and then do it. I don't know if we can end. Oh, he pulled aggro already. Oh, yeah, we can. Okay. Woo! 500 times 3 is 2,000. It's a little bit more than you have to add in Luden's proc and a W. W is like 2 something, Luden procs is like 2 something. Not bad. We'll give it to John just so he doesn't feel bad. <laughs> not bad, not bad, not bad. Numero uno in the damage department is what we like to see. GG, well played. Hope you enjoyed that one. If you're watching on YouTube, like the video, subscribe for more content like this. If you're watching live stream, follow live stream. GG, well played. Thanks for watching. Peace.